the first meal today is out at one of our favorite venues, the Cow Shed. Rupert loves it, he is very excited, very, very excited. Saturday at the cow shed, just had breakfast. I don't like to narrate while I'm sitting there and other people are eating. So I would just like to say that um, I had four eggs, three bacon, two sausage, and I had some, some black pudding, which other people call blood pudding. But it didn't really sit well with me. I, I don't tolerate anything that's not 100% carnivore now. And I'm also beginning to wonder whether eggs are doing me any favors or not. So I might have a little week where I experiment with that. Oh, I've upset the cows. Sorry, sorry. It is half past five on a Saturday night and I'm having a rump steak. This morning, obviously I was at the cow shed and I found that the eggs possibly don't agree with me as much as they used to. But that's just a little phase I'm going through. Anyway, the rump steak here, that will be devoured and that will be my final food for the day, I think. I may have a little bit of um, fillet as well. Just for those that are interested, Jane is having sea bass. So that's a very carnivore meal. It's something I was able to eat, but I got a little bit worried because it used to be very allergic with um, fish. Hospitalized actually, that bad was the allergy. Uh, and I tried some sea bass. I felt a little bit of an itchiness on my throat, so I didn't have it, but boy, it looks good. Quite a few people like me just showing you what's in the air fryer. Rupert barking in the background, by the way. So yeah, there's the rump steak and a couple of bits of fillet. So there's the final meal and tomorrow was scheduled to be a skip day, but because it's Father's Day and Jane has her father coming round, We've moved it. Raymond has allowed me, my coach, has allowed me to move my skip day to Monday. So this is my meal tonight. And then I will probably do two meals tomorrow. Gonna to be interesting because it's a social occasion. So how will I navigate that?